Hi everyone, welcome back. SLA or Service Level Agreement Policies Important Factor in a Business These policies give a clear picture for the company about the services given by the service providers. In this video, we will be discussing about how to manage SLA policies in help desk. For that, let me go to the help desk module and here in the configurations, you have the teams. So let me select one of the team here. And if you go down, you can see the SLA policies. So let me enable it. And here you can give the working hours. So you can choose the working hours accordingly. So this is the working hour for standard 40 hours per week. So after that, let me go back. Go to the configurations here. You have the SLA policies. And let me create a new SLA policy. I'll be giving the name here. And here you can after giving the name, you can give the team here and you can select the priority levels. You can select the type, whether it is an issue or a question. And if you want to create a new type, you can create a new type from here. So I'll give it as issue. And in the tags here, you can select the tags according to the SLA policy that you're creating. And you can also give the customers. And here you have the option to select the read state. So if you want the read state here, you can select the appropriate read states. And let me give the in time that is 24 hours. That's the maximum time for this SLA policy. And let me save it. After saving it, you can see all the details in here. So these are the SLA policies that are created. You can see the teams of the SLA policies, the priority level, the types, the reach stages, and the in time that is the maximum time for the SLA policy. Now let me go here back to the dashboard and create a new ticket. You can create a new ticket from here. So these are the tickets. And if you want to create a new ticket, you can just click on create and you can create a new ticket. So let me create a new tech ticket. Let me give the subject here for this ticket and here you can select the team let me select the customer that is tech addict and by selecting the customer the email the phone has been automatically updated and you can give the assigned person here and you can specify the priority level, the type, and the tags here. And here you can give the comments for the issue if you want. So after that, let me just save it. And here you have the option to change the states. So if the issue is in progress you can just click on in progress or if it's in done state you can click on done state or if you want to cancel the ticket you can cancel the ticket from here and you can just save it and if you go back here and if you go to the tickets you can see here that this stage has been changed and you can see your ticket here so this is how you set a um, SLA policy for a ticket in help desk of Auto 16. That's all for today. Thank you.